Hello everyone, welcome to the Only Office webinar. I'm Julia from Medienstürmer, your host for today. Version 2.6 of Only Office Docspace is now available with multiple enhancements. Would you like to explore the release closer? I will guide you right now. Only Office Docspace is intended to improve collaboration on Office documents and other content with various people you need to interact daily, such as your colleagues, teammates, customers, partners, contractors, sponsors, etc. The platform provides a room-based environment for organizing a clear file structure depending on your needs or project goals. Flexible access permissions and user roles allow you to fine-tune the access to the whole space or separate rooms. The latest update of Only Office Doc Space comes with more than 20 new features and improvements. Version 2.6 is already available in the cloud. The self-hosted build for Linux and Windows will be updated shortly. Let's learn about all the novelties. The latest update brings another room type for which the only Office team got lots of user requests. Besides, you will find several useful features for room management. And welcome the first version of form-filling rooms. For now, you can use it for simple tasks like working with fillable assignments, questionnaires, briefings, collecting feedback, etc. Here, you can upload ready PDF forms from your DocSpace device or template library with several clicks. To work with the uploaded PDF forms further, invite other users to the room for form filling. Or you can copy a public access link to share the room with external users. This way, you can check the filled forms, get responses and analyze data automatically collected into a spreadsheet. For example, we are working on a group study project devoted to various concepts and need to collect ideas for one of the concept form from our teammates and friends. We go to the Rooms section and create a new form filling room, setting the required name, tags and icon. Then we upload our PDF questionnaire, which we have created before in our DocSpace. Alternatively, you can upload a PDF form from your laptop or use one of the ready templates from the integrated form library. Immediately after uploading a form, you can copy a public access link to send it to external users. All of them will have the form filler permission. In case you want to invite attendance present in your doc space, click the Invite Users option in the Room Context menu or via the Room Info panel. When the form filling process is started, you will see two new sections appearing in your room. The Process section contains Forms in Process, so forms which users have started to fill out but haven't yet completed. The Complete section contains the completed forms, so when users click Complete and Submit. When all participants have filled the form, you can access a spreadsheet to generate it in the Complete section. Here you can find and analyze all the answers in one place. Please note, if you have several PDF forms in one room, the Complete and In Process section will include separate dedicated folders for each form. So this is how form filling rooms work. Everything is easy and intuitive and you are welcome to try. Further improvements for DocSpace rooms include an ability to embed public rooms as well as files from these rooms into your website or blog via the embedding settings now accessible directly from the room. Besides in public rooms, it's now possible to copy a link to a separate folder or media file for sharing with external users. What's more, you are now able to duplicate not only files, but also rooms and folders. When duplicating rooms, the icon and tags are copied, however users are removed from the duplicated rooms. Only Office Docspace 2.6 brings several novelties for user management as well. 
easily import users and groups to your doc space from a LDAP server. The edit users will be able to authorize using their LDAP server or Active Directory credentials. If necessary, you can enable the option to automatically synchronize data changes between your doc space and LDAP server. For the account section, there are new hotkeys available. Arrow up and arrow down for lists. Enter and backspace for groups. What else? The developers update user status filtering for the account section. Active means that the user account is activated. Pending invite means the user was invited to DocSpace via email but did not follow the link from the invitation email. Disabled status means that user account is deactivated. Now let's take a look at the improvements for more convenient file management. Would like to open documents for editing in the same tab? Just activate this option via the file management section in your profile. Create new folders in dialogs Move to, copy to, restore and save copy as. Open a media file via an external link when sharing it from documents section. Next update here is faster loading and scrolling of large images via the media viewer thanks to using thumbnail in 4K. And create context menu, which is now available instead of the standard browser menu by right-clicking the mouse within DocSpace sections. Next on your list is updated room and file history. It now supports an extended number of entries for more precise tracking of changes in your rooms. What's new here? For files, it's conversion. For files and folders, renaming, moving and copying. For rooms, the following activities are now also taken in the history. Renaming, changing an icon, adding and removing tags, creating renaming and deleting links, changing user roles and removing users, changing group roles, adding and removing groups. For more comfortable user experience, the following improvements are implemented. Ability to change the language on the login page and an optimized backed up process with less memory consumption. And just a quick reminder for you. In only Office DocSpace 2.6, you can use the latest update of the editor's version 8.1 which includes a full-featured PDF editor with text editing, work with pages, inserting shapes, images, hyperlinks, etc. PDF forms, slide master, animation pane, page color support and more. Well, which new features do you like the most? The latest update is already available in the only Office DocSpace cloud. Sign in to your space to try all the new features yourself or create a free account if you are new to only Office Doc Space. Just scan the QR code and directly access the registration page. Thanks everyone for being with us. We hope you enjoyed the webinar. Try only Office Doc Space 2.6 and share your impressions in social media channels. Your feedback is always much appreciated. Thank you and have a good day. Bye.